Hey everyone, Joel Hansen here, and today we're at the Hot Mama's Canteen in Buffalo, New York to participate in their fire pickle eating contest. Yes, that's right. So today we're gonna to be eating very spicy pickles. It is a one minute contest. That's right, only one minute. This is their fifth annual contest. There's a gentleman who's won the last four years and he's here to defend his title. We're gonna see what we can do. So does the individual eat the most pickles in one minute? There's a maximum of 12 participants and with the $5 registration fee, all of the registration money is the cash prize in the addition of a hot sauce package. They make hot sauce here, and obviously hot pickles. So with that, everybody, let's head on in and see what we can do. Uh, they gave me a beautiful hat, a nice little thingy thing. This is in celebration of Cinco de Mayo, so let's go eat some pickles. And here are the pickles. So they're cut into pretty big spears. That's where we're gonna be eating. So we have no drinks on the table. I'm gonna take, yeah, take this and put it right over there. Yeah, no problem. Everybody has got ten pickles in each one of these containers. As soon as the container is gone, we will. Mighty D, that's where you come in. We're both gonna watch as soon as the containers are gone. We're gonna hit the three final containers or something. All right. Raise your hand when it's done. Hopefully nobody has to use this. Okay. Thank you. Perfect. <laughs> Puke bubble. Right. So, basic rule. No happy pickles do not count. When it's a one-minute contest. Whoever eats the most pickles is the winner. If we have to do a tiebreaker, we wait a couple minutes. That occurs to so people can take a breath. And then we do a tiebreaker. Whoever eats the most pickles is the winner. 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 Pickles in your mouth, you have to open your mouth, you have to put your hands up. Pickles in your mouth, you have to count it. Exactly. And they have to be followed, they have to be gone, nothing to drink until you're done. If you stand up, if you use this, you are just fine. Bye. Alright. Alright. What's, yes, what's the most that someone ate or Jason ate? Uh, his name is Justin. Oh, Justin, I'm sorry. Yeah. Like if 
everybody was in for a shot. My first shot. Yeah. Yeah. Contest record, and I guess I won, so that's pretty cool. We're gonna hang around here some more. It's pretty hot, burning my mouth, having our pickles. For that, right till next time, say happy, healthy, hungry, and happy eating. So, first successfully winning, I got $70. Uh, I did pay five, so $65 net prize, so that's pretty cool. We also got a new record for the pickle number, again, previously 13, now 16. Man, a minute is so short. The pickles are a habanero based pickle, so they are hot, like my lips feel a little puffy. Uh, I'm definitely feeling a bit of like a burn in the mouth, but like nothing in the gut. It's not like ghost peppers or anything that crazy. Um, but a good heat. I did eat the rest of my other pickles too. So that was super cool. A really cool environment. Everybody here is so awesome. So yeah, for real. Maybe get some more footage, but if not, you know where to come. This is a really cool spot here in Buffalo. All right, so that was a lot of fun. What a great environment. Everybody there is just so into it. They were like so loving it. The staff and management were just like beyond exceptional. I also got three bottles of hot sauce for winning. Uh, so that was super cool. I look forward to trying these. The pickles were absolutely delicious. So I look forward to trying the sauces. Um, yeah, really cool spot. Uh, hot Mama's Canteen. Like really, the staff are just really what makes it. It was a great experience. So cool. Everybody was so into it. Great crowd. And yeah, now we got to hit the road. But my mouth is still, my mouth is a little better. It's, it's, you know, it's not, it was hot, but it's not that bad. So anybody, uh, yeah, enjoy the rest of your time. If you're in Buffalo, check this place out. If you like spice and stuff, check this place out. And uh, glad I got to meet everybody there. It was really cool. And until next time, maybe we'll have to come back and eat some more pickles next year. maximum of 12 participants. So however many participants actually show up or pay. There's a max. Taylor Swift, stuff. Like, there's just activities all up and down the street. They call it uh, Clifton Hill, I think they call the area. Look at that down there. There's like IHOP, there's a Burger King. It's a big sign that says Burger King, home of the Whopper or the Frankenstein. That's pretty cool. Uh, there's a big arcade here somewhere, I don't know where it is. And then here we have the famous Sky Wheel, Niagara Sky Wheel. There's a massive Tim Hortons because Canada. But yeah, massive Sky Wheel, which is a great big Ferris wheel. Here's some dinosaurs with some mini golf. Actually, there's the arcade. It's in that bowling thing. And there's the big arcade. Some funnel cakes. And here is this Niagara Speedway that everybody's been freaking out about. It's like, uh, it's like Mario Kart themed. There's a better look at the Frankenstein with the Whopper. Again, here's this uh, Niagara Speedway, which is like the mini, or Mario Kart, blah, 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 inspired raceway.